We be recording. That's it? Yep. Hi. I'm here to pick up some reports that I've requested. Can we stop videoing right now? You don't have my permission to video right now. Well, you realize this is a public place and you're a public I'm employee. I'm asking you not videotaping, please. Do you see what the sign says on the wall? I'm asking you not to videotape me. I'll, you know, I'll talk with you in a moment once you put some videotape away. Well, I believe he's within his rights to record me. I don't want to be videotaped, and I'm telling you that right now. I don't want to be videotaped. Well, you're, you're a public official working on public what property. Ask, What's that? Okay. Wow. We, we are dangerous people. Sounds According. like they want to make this video very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> All I'm here to do is pick up some paperwork that I told is ready for me. Now we have the commander on the way. I mean, really this much trouble for some paperwork. This seems kind of ridiculous. Mm-hmm. And just in case anyone was curious, what it says on the wall is... Not to mention a public place, public officials that get paid by public money. Probably could have been done and out of here by now. I help you? I'm just here to pick up some paperwork. What paperwork? Some reports that I'd asked for uh, about a week ago. Okay. What, uh, what's your name? Justin Sargent. Justin Sargent. Okay. Yep. What was the paper? You looking for arrest reports? Or yes, sir. Arrest reports for you? Yes, sir. Okay. They should be ready. I was uh, I was called and said that they would be ready. They've already been sent up to be. Uh, Blacked out or censored or whatever you want to call it? Yeah, yeah, redacted. Yeah, yeah okay. okay. Redacted. Okay. Alright, it's going to be 18 apiece. Okay. I was informed that I could look at them without taking them out of the building. Uh, I don't know anything about that. The, that's what I was told last time I was here when I asked about them. Who told you that? The lady that was here. Who's the lady? Uh, I don't remember her name. Okay, I don't, I don't know. Where, where would you look at them? Just right here. I'm not leaving the building with them. Maybe you can put them on a desk and get a picture of them. Once I put this out to you, you know, this, you know, what am I going to do? Tap you to get it back from me? You know what I'm saying? I mean. Well, if you feel better about coming out here with them. I mean, I got other stuff I'm doing right now. Let me find out. I never heard that before. That you could just look at them. Can you just look at them? Well, could you just take pictures with your camera of them? Uh, I don't see why not. I'll ask them, but. Yeah, no. See, the problem is too is that you can reproduce these. You can use your video camera and your. Uh, in your in your camera, take pictures of them, so then you reproduce it. So then, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Okay, like, but still, I mean, that, that's that's something that I should have access to either way. You, I was so told that it was a copies of them because that's the whole purpose of when well, we charge for these because it's costing us to produce them for you. So me handing them to you, and you taking pictures of them, and which you probably that's what you're probably going to want to do. I, I'm not. You can't do that. You're going to be reproducing our. our uh, I was told it was eighteen dollars to take the physical no, copies out of the building. You know, each one breaks down to eighteen dollars for each report. That's what it breaks down to. It goes by the page. So I was just told that it's $18 an hour Well, then I would suggest uh, letting everyone know so everyone's on the same page as far as people that work here because I don't appreciate being told that I could look at them. And I was told that it was $18 okay. to take okay. them out of the building. Here's the thing. Okay, you're not going to look at them. What you're doing is, is you're going to want to take pictures of them. That's okay. okay. That's, that's, that's still within my rights, though. No, it's not in your rights. Not in your rights. If you want to buy them, you can have them. But the, you can't come in and ask to see them and then make copies of them because that's defeating the whole purpose of the, of the way it's set up. Right, but, but still, you're charging me for something that you might mind anyway, is what I'm saying. No. This is actually, this is actually the, the, the property of the city of Concord. Okay? So, the city of Concord charges you to get copies of, of, of the arrest. But it's public information. It is public information, but it is a price to do a business. And that's what it comes down to. Right. So if you don't you don't want to pay for them, then I I, I can't. You can file a complaint with whoever. Um, I don't know what to tell you, but you not you can't get them until unless you pay for them. 
Okay, well, like I said, uh, you might want to make sure everybody realizes that that works for you guys here, because I don't appreciate being told that I can look at them. It's like, see, see what you're doing here is, and your job, your buddy over here, you're trying to, you're trying to spark something that it isn't, and he's filming. Yeah. I'm just trying to get gain access to the information that you guys have about. No, you're not trying to gain access. What you're trying to do is, is you don't want to pay. And then, you're right. Unfortunately, you have to, pay. you have to pay. That's just the way it is. That's that's the, that's the, what the city requires you to pay for copies of reports. All right. Well, well like I said, I, I just don't appreciate being told otherwise. Do. And then when it comes same down to it, same rules for everybody else out there that wants a copy of, of, of public information. They got to pay for it. Okay. Okay, well, if, that, if that's how it's going to work, that's fine. But like I said, I don't appreciate being told one thing and then having it be something else when I get here to take them. Have a wonderful day. I'm surprised they don't have digital uh, copies. I don't know. Well, we got some great footage today. Yeah, it works, I guess. May not have gotten what you came down here for. So, Justin, what, what were the forms that you were coming to try and get today? I just wanted to uh, have the information on when they arrested me. It's just some arrest reports from actually years ago now. Um, it's public information, so it should be available. I don't see why it even became a big deal. Okay, I think so they're just mad because we came in there with cameras and they don't like being recorded. So do you, th is uh, this arrest report, is it information that would be given to you uh, prior to the case? Because, I mean, was, if this was public information, was it not included in your discovery when you uh, went to court? Or did they not give you a discovery? To be perfectly honest, I don't even remember. Did you, so you never received an actual written report from the police about the narrative of the events surrounding your arrest? Not that I'm aware of. Um, there very well could have been, I suppose, in the discovery. Uh, it all seemed like mumbo jumbo to me back at the time because I didn't really know what any of it meant. The paperwork just confused me. It just it threw me for a loop. I didn't understand it all. And that, that's the whole point of it. They want to confuse people so they don't know what they're doing. So then they can do stuff like this down the line, I guess, or something. Well, what I think is interesting is it, it sounds like the information you were trying to get is uh, public information that you would have gotten with your discovery. It sounds like maybe your, your case didn't get far enough that you were able to do that. But now that you didn't take it to trial, it costs, I guess, $18 to get these forms. Yeah, I guess so. Because, yeah, I didn't take the trial. I ended up taking the plea deal because I was scared. Um, I guess like most normal people, when they get arrested and they don't know what's going on and they don't really know their rights, people get scared. And they just give them the plea deal. I'm guilty of it myself. I won't be doing that anymore, though. That's for sure.